Shut up and sit down. Good evening, sports fans, and welcome to another night of Hiller Volleyball. I'm Steve Sweetapple, along with my partner, Matt Clancy, as the Hopkinton Hillers welcome in the Frontier Red Hawks to the gymnasium. Hopkinton just won uh, the Tri-Valley League by defeating Ashland on Friday night, 3-0 sweep. Girls are 17-0 overall, 15-0 in the Tri-Valley League play. This is senior night and the last game of the season. Should be a great match, Matt. Yeah, really looking forward to seeing how uh, tonight's match goes. I know that the Hillers have played a lot of volleyball over the last few days, so hopefully they're not too tired for this game, but it should be a good one. Yep, it should be a very good match. Uh, Frontier, a divisional powerhouse in uh, Division Three, perennial um, state champs. They come in, well-coached, well-schooled team, a little down this year. Overall, their record is 12-7, uh, and 4-4 four and four in league play. So a little bit of a down year for Coach Sean McDonald, but I'm sure the girls are going to be very competitive and should be a, a very entertaining match. Uh, it is senior night, so we'll throw it down to the floor for Coach Grabmeyer. Thank you all for coming to support us this evening at our last regular season home match versus the Frontier Red Hawks. This is a special night, our senior night, when we show our appreciation for the seniors in the volleyball program. But first, we'd like to recognize the seniors who are here tonight from Frontier Regional High School Volleyball Program. So would you please step forward when I say your name? Jalen Sullivan. And Kamani Topolsky. Congratulations, Frontier Seniors. Now it's time to honor our Hopkinton Volleyball Seniors and their parents. When I call you and your parents' names, please meet your family, pose for a picture, and then take your place on the end line. Keelan Boyle, Marie and Mike Boyle. Jamie Hart, Jenny, and Chris Hart. Morgan Allen, Mary Doherty, and Tom Allen. Ashley McDermott, Karen McDermott, and Ed Lugo. Angie Grabmeyer, Margie, and Joe Grabmeyer.
Parents and families, we appreciate all that you have done for the girls and the program. Feeding, driving, cheering. You are outstanding fans for not only supporting your own daughters, but encouraging and caring about the entire team. Thank you. These senior athletes have been an important part of the volleyball program for the past four to five years. They are leaders, motivators, and role models. They are committed to team and sportsmanship, and they set excellent examples for the younger girls in the program. We have been privileged to be involved with such a wonderful group of athletes. Thank you, seniors. Hopkinton Volleyball would like to thank all of the parents and fans here tonight for helping us to have such a memorable and successful 2019 season. I couldn't make it through. And I'd like to welcome everyone to tonight's last regular season home match, Frontier Red Hawks versus Hopkinton Hillers. Now, would everyone please rise for our national anthem? to get the match underway tonight. A very nice recognition for the senior class here tonight, Matt. Yeah, a really nice ceremony there to honor the seniors. They'll all go on to do great things. So as I said, Hillers coming in 17-0 overall. Red Hawks 12-7 overall. Red Hawks coming in off a 3-1 uh, to one loss to Longmeadow on Friday night. Hillers with a 3-0 sweep of Ashland, which clinched the Thai Valley League title for the Hillers for the fifth season in a row. So out there on the floor for the girls, it's Morgan, Angie, Rachel, Kate Powers, Ashley. Is that Hannah? Yep, Hannah and Bub. And on the floor for Frontier, we've got number 17, Charlotte Duet. Number nine, Olivia Dean. Number seven, Kimani Adana Topolsky. Number 21, Abigail Roberts. Number 23, Olivia Rosewarn. And number 20, Sophia Stilla. <coughs> And at least from looking at the stats, it looks like everything's going to flow through Dean, number nine. And Rachel Lorette gets us underway. Great first serve. Bump set over to Dean. Just sends it to the back row. Morgan's there. Rachel outside. Grabmeyer. Dean with a block. Oh. Great play from wow. Kate Power. Great, Great reaction play. time at the net. <laughs> Thought that point was over. I did too. 
Kate even seemed like to surprise herself yeah. when she just bumped that back up. Dean with a block. It was pushed wide. Yeah, everything will be going through Dean. She's uh, got 246 kills on the air. Very impressive. Morgan receives that well. Lorette, Bub, puts it deep, handled well. Outside to Dean again. Hopkinson was there with a block, went off Bub's hands. Rachel couldn't get to it. Tied up at two. Allen gets to that. Lorette pushes it outside. Nice swing from Grabmeyer. Puts it into the open spot inside yep, out Hillers. She found that open area. So good at doing that. Yeah, she did that a lot Friday night. Took she a lot did. off and just placed the ball. Billy checks in. Bub back to serve. <laughs> Appanel with the nice put away as the middle hitter. Side out for the Red Hawks. Sydney Scanlon back to serve. Sam, Kate just thumped over from Morgan. That was just set yeah, way tough, outside. Tough set. <coughs> Side out Hillers. Ashley McDermott checking in. Allen back to serve. Nice put away wow. by Dean. Really nice put away there. Deep to the back corner. Side out, Frontier. A little earlier start time tonight because Frontier's coming all the way in from the South Deer Deerfield. Yep. Morgan handles that. Rachel. Uh, hitting error from Angie. First pass was so close to the net. Rachel just yeah, didn't threw everything off. Yeah, she couldn't do anything with it. Angie. Lorette. Bump set. That's going to be. Once again, too close to the net. Yeah, Dean also has a good serve. She's got 54 aces on the year, 126 total points. A nice serve. Handcuffed Angie on that. Getting the serve placement from the assistant coach. Allen, Lorette, Bub, or no, Millie. Uh, Millie's timing was off there. Yeah, a couple of errors here early from Hawkington. Yeah, Coach Grabmeyer calls a timeout. Girls look a little flat. They do. A little tired, and Coach Grabmeyer was actually worried about that. We were talking before the game between the excitement of Pepperelli on Friday and then the, the game that night against Ashland. There's the dance on Friday night, and then they got up bright and early Saturday morning to play a 16-team tournament in Westboro where they actually made it to the finals and lost to Barnstable in the last set. It was a three-set final, and they lost 15-13 to 13 in the final set. So the girls have played a lot of yeah, volleyball. It's a lot of volleyball over the last few days. She's a... So Mike Tarosian just giving me some instructions in my ear. It always scares me when Mike pops into my head. <laughs> so we're going out live on YouTube now. Uh, 
And Morgan saves that, uh, but it's out wide. Yeah, Hopkinton having some trouble here. Yeah. Returning the serve. <laughs> Sam handles that one well. Rachel outside, Millie long. So good, good run of serve here from Dean. Yeah. Rachel, Grabmeyer, nice, nice placement from Angie. <laughs> really nice. You can see her take a peek at the court right before she followed through. Mirabella checking in. Rachel will depart. Grabmeyer back to serve. Yeah, hitting error on the Red Hawks. That was a well placed serve there. Ball. Sam, good get. Outside Millie, down the line. Per oh, went outside the antenna. Landed in the court, yeah, but went outside say. the antenna. Lucci, outside, good swing. Ashley, back to her. She goes deep. Dean, a little confusion there, but works to Red Hawks' advantage. Pellucci, nice, nice swing. swing. Side out, Hillers. Yeah, there's not much Frontier could do with that one. Bub checks in. Sam departs. Millie back to serve. Angie, outside, nice pushover. Wasn't a lot that Bub could do with that. Nice oh, save by Millie. Great dig. And that's long. Well fought point there by Hopkinton. Yep. <clears throat> you can almost see a little lethargy in the girls' mm -hmm. in the girls' step as they're approaching. And their jump too, yep. yeah. <clears throat> A uh, little mishandle. It was Martin New just handcuffed her. Hopkinton trails by two here in the first set. Miss hit from Dean. Now Frontier struggling a little bit. Get that ball back over the net on the serve. Serve receipt. Free ball, see if the girls can use it. Millie, Angie, outside. Nice swing from Bub. Dean from the back, Morgan. Nice arm bar. Oh, great save. <laughs> great save. And a nice wow, block. They earned that point. Dermot with a block. Well-earned point. Maybe that'll get the blood flowing. Yeah. Just off Ashley's fingertips. Morgan had it, but just changed direction. Hannah Quinlan checks in. Millie departs. Olivia Roseborn back to serve. Service error, side out, Hillers. And on Friday night it was Dig Pink <coughs> fundraiser, and the team raised over $2,400. Wow, that's awesome. So a, a great turnout for that event. Thank everybody that helped. 
and rotation violation on the Red Hawks. That's a do over. Apparently it wasn't a rotation violation after Coach McDonald had to talk to the ref. Yeah, the set was too far. Yep. Nothing that uh, Martino could do with do it do with that. Service error from Ashley. Morgan Allen checks back in. Ashley departs. Martineau back to serve. Tied up at 13. Two straight service errors yeah. for the Red Hawks. Coach McDonald's not happy with that. Sophia Stilla checks in as does Rachel Lorette, and Lorette back to serve. Outside to Dean. Hannah just couldn't handle yeah, that. Really well placed. Good speed, good placement. They definitely set the ball to her a lot. Hannah, Rachel, down the line, Bub, nice swing. <laughs> Millie checks back in, Hannah departs, and Bub goes back to serve. Outside to Dean, that was way outside. No. Just tipped at the net and directed yeah. down the line. Yep, she just put it down the line. Scanlon back to serve. Berenson checking in for Bub. Sam handles that well. Rachel outside, Grabmeyer. Bump set out to Dean. Lorette. Millie blocked. That was Apinel with the block. Frontier in front by one here in the first set. And Sam mishandles that. Girls need a side out here. Morgan, Rachel, outside, Grabmeyer. Oh, just long. Just long, really close. And Coach Grabmeyer calling her last time out here. You get two timeouts each team per set. You don't see Hopkinton having to take two timeouts in the first set very often. No. So the girls, as, they, as we said, they played in the Westboro Tournament and they lost in the finals to Barnstable. Hopkinton right now is ranked fifth in the state. And uh, a few of the teams that they will hopefully see in the playoffs, they, they did get to see at this tournament. So Minichog was there, Westboro was there, Algonquin was there, Barnstable. And the, the tournament, uh, state tournament seedings will be released tomorrow. So most likely Hopkinton will get a first round bye. So check HCAM's website and we'll keep you up to date with all of the sports seedings.
Allen, Lorette, Grabmeyer, point. <laughs> Beautiful. Side out, Hillers. Side to Dean. Millie gets that. Angie. Millie sends it deep. And a free ball. McDermott. Lorette. Back to McDermott. Nice. nice. Ashley. So that was really nice. She controlled it over the net. Got the set back to her and finished it. Grabmeyer, down the Ooh. line. Down the line is right, with authority. Outside to Dean, great block. Grabmeyer, see if they feed Angie. McDermott, net violation. Net violation. Appenel is into the net. And Coach McDonald calling timeout just to settle the girls down. So earlier tonight, the JV2 team won 2-0, and the JV1 team also won 2-0. So Hillers will be trying for a clean sweep tonight. And the JV1 team finished 17-0. It's their third straight undefeated season. And I, I believe the JV2 team lost twice, so they probably finished 14-2. Nice block. Great block. Kept alive. Dean one hands it over. Berenson gets to it. Lorette. Nice play, Millie. Just once again, the set was close to the net. Yeah. That's all Millie could do. <laughs> Double hit. I think, you know, all things considered, after the busy weekend, the rainy Monday for Hopkins to be up in this first set, <laughs> it's a win. And that's out. Good eyes, Angie. Rachel Lorette, Angie Grabmeyer, blocked. <laughs> Dean with a great block. She'll go back to serve. Martino checks in for Frontier. 21-19. See if the girls can side out here and stop Dean from the run she had the first time around. Angie, Rachel, Millie. Nice, nice put away, away by Millie. Millie. Lucci checking in, Lorette departs, Grabmeyer back to serve. Nice serve. 23-19, Hillers in front. Lila Evans checking in. Ah, nice 
nice. Yeah, it was a deep serve. It was deep. Not sure if that was going out or not. It was going to be close. They had no choice but to try to play it. So here we are at set point in the first set. Angie floats that one deep. Uh, it's going to be trouble. Kept alive. A net viol yep, yeah, net violation. So that'll be it. Hopkinson takes the first set 25 to 19. Girls will switch sides and we'll step away and be back momentarily. My name is Kurt. My name is Nina. A gun? I'm Haley. Hi, my name is Jake. We're the Hiller Volleyball Team. My name is Emma. My name is May. My name is Shelby. My name is Sophie. We're Al and Gal and we love H Camp. Hey, I want to be, uh, camp. We love H Camp. And I volunteer for H Camp TV. And I watch H Camp TV. And I love H Camp TV. And I love H Camp TV. We love H Camp TV. And we're back for set number two as uh, Hopkinton took that first set over Frontier 25 to 19. Kind of a back and forth seesaw match there until it uh, got to about 18 and then Hopkinton finally st started to put their foot on the pedal, Matt. Yeah, definitely a little bit of a back and forth set. They looked a little bit tired at certain points, but they were able to pull it out. You know, Margie used two timeouts, gathered, uh, gathered the girls and they came out swinging. Uh, we take a look at the stats here from the first set. Angie led the way with four kills. When it came to assists, Rachel Lorette had eight. And when it came to digs, Morgan Allen led the way with five, followed by Millie with four. And Hopkinton Sports, HKM Sports, is supported by our viewers and by the dentist at Hopkinton. The dentist at Hopkinton provides services including comprehensive dental care, same-day crowns, facial aesthetics, periodontal care, cosmetic dentistry, and implant dentistry. The dentist at Hopkinton is located at 77 Main Street and online at hopdent.com. So out there on the floor for the Hillers, we have Kate Sestari, Angie, and Bub in the front row with back row of Rachel, Hannah, and Morgan. And for Frontier, we've got Kimani Adana Topolsky, Olivia Dean, Charlotte Duet all in the front. And in the back row, we've got Sophia Stilla, Olivia Rosewarn, and Riley Eisler. Bump set to Dean. Good approach. Great get from Hannah. Rachel, a little confusion there at the net. Oh, Kate with it. Kate had the block, just couldn't control it. Rolled to the left, nobody was there. Still at a serve. Morgan receives that. Rachel outside, Bub. Not much deep. Oh. Bub started for it and then mm -hmm. backed they off. They're all watching it. A little campfire action there. Angie, Lorette, bump set, Grabmeyer. Nice get. Back to Dean. Angie with a block. Nice block at the net. Cassie White checking in. Rachel exits. Grab Meyer to serve. Handled well. They're pushing it outside. Dean. No. Never came over. Yeah. I wasn't sure whether Kate got a piece of that, pushed it back. It's tough to tell. Yeah, when it's right in front of the up ref. Yeah. Nice, nice eyes from Kate. Yeah. She was right there in case it she was, was ready for it. <laughs> a 
Oh, nice. Oh. Still a nice dive. Yep, nice pancake from Bub, but still rolled left. Yeah, set was close to the net. Dean couldn't do anything but just push it down the line. Good heads up play. Isler with the serve. Angie. Cassie, good swing. Wow. <laughs> Didn't look like she swung that hard at it, but had no. a lot of power behind it. No, and the ball had, I mean, Angie was just lunging to yeah. try to get to it. It had a lot of spin on it, tough to control. Mel checks in. Bub back to serve. Good swing from Cassie. Usually the girls have a uh, spaghetti dinner too with the Frontier team immediately after the game. I forgot to ask Coach Grabmeyer if they were doing it. It is a long bus ride back. <coughs> Outside to Dean. Boy, she's got a great swing. Angie just couldn't pull that off the net. Sam checks in for Bub. Scanlon back to serve for the Red Hawks. Hiller's up by one. Yeah, and Scanlon is a freshman, very impressive. Yeah, they've got, what, two or three freshmen yeah. on the team? Four. Yeah, it's a very young team, only two seniors. <coughs> Sam, Angie. Cassie blocked. Appinell with another block. Set a few tonight. Tied up at five here in the second set. Hopkinton took the first set in this best of five match. Sam, Angie, Kate. Angie, Morgan, bump set. Mel pushes it down the line. Nope, Dean hits it long. Well, in some ways it makes uh, it easier to defend because you know 90% of the sets yeah. are going to Dean. <laughs> exactly, you know exactly where it's going. Nice serve from Morgan. Yeah, setter can't get mm. to it. Yeah, she watched that one go over her head. Scanlon served and had a was in the back right position, so she's got a long way to go to get to setting position. And Scanlon only a freshman, so your setter is mm. a freshman. Back set, Dean. And Appinell takes the first hit. Nobody yeah. was there to challenge that yeah. at the net. And Morgan Allen had the dig, but it had so much on it. Came back over the net, and Appinell just powered it right down. Dean to serve. Gets her serve positioning from the assistant coach. Ashley McDermott. Martineau. Mel handled that. Cassie with another great one. Arm bar, pulled off the net, but Scanlon went into the net. Side out, Hillers. Lorette checks back in. Cassie departs. Rachel goes to the service line. She's been so solid serving this year. Great serve. Sam, bump set, Cassie. This nice is a really play. nice bump set by Sam. It's perfectly placed. Four point lead for the Hillers here in the second set. Nice block. 
McDermott. Yeah, they're starting to get into a little bit of a rhythm here. Another good serve from Lorette. Six point lead for the Hillers. And just serves that one out. Side out frontier. Appinell back to serve. So that's a bullet. Angie. Ashley puts it down the line. Dean hits the floor. And that's out. Side out. Mel back to serve. Bub checks in. It's time for a bub point, I think. <laughs> McDermott. Nice job by Ashley. It was Arm blocked. Arm it over. And net violation. Oh, double hit. It didn't look like a double hit. Scanlon goes outside, Martineau. And that violation, or no, outside the antenna. So they're starting to put a little distance here. Morgan, Rachel, Grabmeyer. Good swing from Ange. Yeah, it was tough for Dean to handle. Came in about shoulder height. I thought Coach McDonald would have called a timeout yeah. here with nine point lead for the Hillers. Yeah, this is this is the run you want to see the girls make with this rotation. You got Dean on the back row. Don't have a, a lot of power at the net. That's when a great Dean's, point. When Dean's in the back. Rose Warren back to serve. Hannah Quinlan checks in. Mel departs. Hannah gets to that. Rachel. Angie, wow. great save. <laughs> Down the line. Girls looked a little disorganized there. They were still recovering from the previous play. Hannah, Rachel outside, Bub. Dean handles that. Push it to Martineau. And she just whew, puts she it down the line. Tapped it over. Yeah. Girls need a side out here. Hannah, Rachel. Back set, Grabmeyer. Blocked, but yep. there was no stopping Too that. Too much power from Angie. Side out, Hillers. Starry checks back in. McDermott to serve. Uh, double hit. That one I can see. Yes. long out wide good serve really good serve <laughs> little confusion there from the red hawks 
after the, the first pass. Hit to Dean. Wow. I, didn't, I didn't think that. <laughs> I was going to say, was I was waiting for the ref to blow the whistle. <laughs> Double hit. Wow. I didn't think that that Ashley got to that pancake. Yeah, She's still either. celebrating it. <laughs> <laughs> the bench loved to see that one. Yeah. I think Coach Grabmeyer is even going down to give her a little <laughs> more of an effort. Yep. She is. She's getting an extra <laughs> high five from Coach Grabmeyer. And Dean just puts that one back. Yeah, there was a big opening there. Angie just backed up. Roberts serving. Angie mishandles that. Quinlan gets it to the back row, and that's out. Nobody was there. Yeah. Everybody was headed towards Dean. Too much angle. Cassie checks back in. Grab Meyer to serve. Nice block. Nice block at the net. Cassie with a block. And Coach McDonald calling a timeout now. Hillers in front, 22 to 13 here in the second set. Hopkinton took the first set, 25 to 19. Yeah, they've opened up quite a commanding lead here in the second set. Yep, yeah, first five, six points, you know, for the start of the set was close. But then Hopkinton started to separate themselves from the Red yeah. Hawks. So a lot of mistakes there from Frontier as well. Coach Grabmeyer, his family getting some face time. <laughs> I'm sure Joe's happy with that. <laughs> Two thirteen. Pillars in front, and she's serving. Kate, oops. Kate miss hit that. Boy, Dean just her approach is so so clinical. I it mean, really it a, is perfect it was, almost every time. It was a poor set, and she just waited, reached back. Timing is so good. Back set. Bub just sends that cross court. They go, and there's a miss hit. One of the few times Jinkster hits it. Hiller's two points away from closing out the second set. Cassie checks back in. Caden back to serve. Outside to Dean. And that's blocked wide by Cassie. Side out, Red Hawks. Cassie. She was a little off balance. Yeah, set was a little. Yeah, the set wasn't perfect. No, set <coughs> was a little behind her.
Sam. Good first pass. Great cross court. Good swing. That was really nice out. timing. It's a great first pass from Sam. Here we are at set point for second set. Hopkinton took the first set. Morgan floats that one in. Armbar, wow. nice tip over from McDermott. Good heads up play. Angie. McDermott. Yes. Nice back set. Actually that, earned that one. She did. She deserved that point. Hillers take the second set. 25 to 16 for a 2-0 lead here in the best of five. Girls are going to switch sides, and we'll be back in just a minute. Have you ever considered texting and driving? If so, you should know the consequences. If caught texting and driving for the first time, you could get an $100 fine plus your license taken away for 60 days. The consequences only get worse the more you get caught. Even if you don't get caught, there could be serious effects. You could get into a car accident and hurt yourself or someone else. Texting and driving is a very dangerous combination, so stop before this happens to you. And we're back for the third set here as the Hillers took the first two sets from Frontier. In uh, second set, they started to distance themselves a little bit more, Matt. Yeah, what they really did. They, uh, they made the plays that they needed to make and a couple of unforced errors from Frontier, but Hopkinton took advantage. So uh, we take a look at the stats from the second set uh, with Hitting and kills, we've got Angie with two, Melanie with two, and Cassie with two. When it came to assists, Angie led the way with five. And when it came to digs, Morgan Allen led the way with three. Nice balanced, very balanced attack and defensive play from the girls. So out there on the floor, we have Kate Powers, Angie, and Cassie up front with Rachel, Ashley, and Hannah in the back. Morgan will check in for Ashley momentarily. So the girls will, they'll know <coughs> sometime tomorrow when, where, and who they play in the state tournament. They should come away with at least, uh, most likely a number one seed for the Central West. Yeah, that'll be exciting to, to see the seedings tomorrow. The girls will have at least one home game before moving to neutral. Could even be two before moving to a neutral site. And we're underway. Ooh. And that one just caught everyone watching. Side out, Frontier. Morgan, Angie, sent deep, Cassie, outside to Dean. Oh, just blocked wide by Kate. Yeah, they were there, she was there for the block. Oh, great save from Rachel. Rose Warren out to Dean, blocked again, but wide. Morgan, Rachel, bump set, good swing from Cassie. Wow, that was a nice save by Frontier. Almost another one. Side out, Hillers. Ange back to serve. Mirabella checking in. Rachel departs. Hannah. 
Hannah gets to that. Angie. And that was too close to the net. Nothing Maria Bella could do with it. Side out. Appenell checks in. Kate Powers. Bump set to Dean, pushes it down the line. That was nice vision. Yep, good heads up play from the junior. Good approach from Mirabelle. Wow. Very nice timing. Put it in a great location. Side out. Cassie checks in. Nice serve. Sam with an ace. It's a long way to run for your setter. She doesn't call for the help though. She's, it's her ball. Guess where they're going with this one. <laughs> they were going to Dean, but it was a double hit. Sam's got a nice little service run going here. Great, wow. great, great that angle. A no angle <laughs> cross court kill. The set was so far <laughs> outside, that was really the only thing she could do. Rose Warren back to serve. Frontier in front by two here in the third set. Hopkinson took the first two sets. Angie, Cassie, Dean keeps it alive. And nice point for the Hillers. Kate Powers back to serve. Hillers within one. Free ball here. Kate, Angie, Ashley. Nice play. <laughs> she pulled them all. Yep. Tied up at seven. Oh, Dean keeps that alive. Great save from Angie. Sam gets to it. Angie, back set, Mirabella. That was a nice deep hit by Mirabella. Ooh, service error from Kate. Tied up at eight, side out. Morgan Allen checks back in for Kate. Dean back to serve. Girls need a side out here, and then go on a couple service runs. Morgan Allen handles that, and that's gonna make it. Wow, <laughs> great effort by the Hillers. Nice job by Morgan Allen to somehow muster that over the net from the back row. I think Morgan gave that everything it had and it <laughs> just made it. 
Rachel Lorette checks in, goes back to serve. Nice play, Ashley. Nice job by Ashley. Pushed outside, and Frontier very good on that angled shot. They really are. Appenel will go back to serve. One point lead for the Hillers here in the third set. Angie, Dean gets to that, just put over. McDermott with a set. And nice play from Cassie. Gives Frontier a little bit of their own medicine. <laughs> yeah. Hannah checks in. She'll go back to serve. Cassie checks back in. Sam and Mel depart. Dean tip gets to that. Blocked, kept alive. Yep. Net. Not sure who it was, but the set was close to the net. I think it was Dulette. Thirteen to nine. Pillars in front here in the third set. Good serve. Pushed over. Angie gets to it. Rachel bump set to McDermott. Blocked. Great save. Uh, Rachel's trying to sell it that she got the pancake. Yeah. <laughs> Side out. Frontier. Roberts back to serve. Rachel, bump set, Angie. <laughs> wow. She put a lot behind that one. <laughs> she put a lot. <laughs> Kate Powers checks in. Ashley McDermott departs. Morgan Allen back to serve. Four point lead for the Hillers. Double hit from Rachel. Steve Sweetapple and Matt Clancy up here in the Crow's Nest. We'd like to thank the rest of the HCAM crew. Bob Hamilton and John Ritz down on the floor with the cameras. Mary Arnott back up here in the Crow's Nest with us. Side, side out, Hillers. Samantha Dings doing graphics and Tom Dings directing us. And Tom is very quiet in my ear, unlike Mr. Tarosian. Angie back to serve. Five point lead for the Hillers. Nice block from Cassie. Or no. Yeah, it was. Oh, Cassie sends that one just long. Red Hawks within four. Hannah gets to that. Oh, I was wondering when we were going to see a <laughs> dump over. Heads up play from Angie. She usually does that a couple times a game. Side out, Hillers. Sam checks in for Cassie. Mel checks in. 
for Hannah. Outside to Dean. Nice swing. Good point for the Red Hawks. Rose Warren back to serve. Cassie, Rose Warren gets to it. Outside to Dean, just taps it. Angie's out, bump set. Nice wow. swing. A really Good nice swing, swing there by Nell. That back right corner was wide open. That's funny, when she hit that, she didn't hit it hard, but no. she hit it with, she came up and over the ball, and I thought it was gonna go long, but it just had just top dove spin. Just, right yep, in at the just end. Just dropped right in. Kate Powers serves Ooh. that long. Side out. And Jean Kaminsky, Kaminsky, helping out with the graphics as well. That's the first time Tom's talked in my ear in like four games. Thank you, Tom. <laughs> Sam, Angie, Mel, oh, just sends that long. <laughs> Sam, Angie, in the middle to McDermott. Oh. oh. At first, I wasn't sure if that was going to go in. Yeah. <laughs> Dean serving. Oh, that was nice, a nice serve. serve. Coach Grabmeyer called a timeout there. It's her first. You get two per set. Yeah, Dean gave them a little bit of trouble on the serve in the first set, but since then, it seems like Hopkinton's been able to neutralize her a bit. Yeah. Now she's back. And you can see Frontier is a well coached team. Coach McDonald's going to have the girls ready to play. This is the final game of the regular season. And as we said, the seedings will be released tomorrow for the state tournament. Sam, Angie, nice set. Good approach from Cassie. Wow. Roundhouse kept alive. Outside to Mirabella and long again. That was a nice save by Frontier. It was, great roundhouse from the back. Riley Isler with a nice roundhouse. Sam, Morgan, bump set. Cassie just sends that to the back row. Oh, Ooh. little miscommunication there. Set out. Hillers. Mirabella departs. Rachel enters, and she will go back to serve. Tipped. Oh, great. Nicely kept alive. Lorette kept that alive. Bump set. Free ball, and that's, that's out. Going out. Two-point lead for the Hillers here late in the third set. Hopkinton took the first two sets. It's 
job by Rachel. Oh. Side out, Red Hawks. Epinel back to serve. Oh, that one caught the net. Nice Sam. effort by Sam Berenson. And off the netting. That serve skimmed the net and picked up some speed. Tied up at 20. Morgan, Sam, Angie. Morgan, let's see. Nice swing from Mel. Sam, Rachel, Angie. Sam, Rachel back to Angie. This time down the line, that could be trouble. Kept oh, alive. They played it off the net. McDermott, open spot, great play. That was a nice rally, probably one of the longest we saw all night. Yep. <laughs> Hannah checks in for Mel. Cassie checks in for Sam. Quinlan back to serve. A nice serve. 22 to 20. And Coach McDonald calling a timeout here. Just to settle the girls down a little bit. And this is, you know, you want to make these runs when mm -hmm. Dean is on the back line. That's really the, the one real danger, dangerous threat that Frontier has is when she's at the net. 